a good one. That's a fatty. That's a big old fish. Made it to the first pond. Starting out with a little chatterbait. He's swimming with it. I never even felt it buzz. As soon as it hit the water, he must have grabbed it. I was like, what in the hell is going on? <laughs> oh man, I didn't tighten that drag. Maybe not. It's act pretty tight. It's just as limber as this rod is, man. You might as well just have that drag clamped. on the ground is going to be mushy. And it's mushy. Let's go pitch in there and see what we can find. Got one. Oh, good one. Not too bad. That's a good fish. Oh, he's pulling some drag. Come here, big boy. Not too bad. <laughs> Tell you what, those G lock hooks, he wasn't going anywhere. That big boy. Get that tail beat up. That's what I'm talking about. That's a good fish right there. Heck yeah. Hope you guys can see that. Pitched right in there on those rocks. She came and smashed it. Didn't really feel much. She just kind of picked it up. She's pulling drag, and I remember I locked that drag down yesterday. So she's pretty stout. We'll see you later. Peace. Good fish. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. It's always fun when you like know you got a stout fish. You're like, that's a, I don't know how big it is, but that is a strong fish. All right, so got to rig back up. Sink hook, G-lock hook, awesome hook. Uh, Put a little beat on there, so give me some noise, maybe. Don't move the bait. Water's clear enough, it's just kind of not the clearest. A couple, maybe a foot of visibility. A lot of stuff in the water. Yeah, I'm stuck on a branch right now. A lot of branches and stuff in the water. Oh, I'm stuck again. I really don't want to lose this. No, oh, broke off. No swim jig. Mm. Yeah, we'll throw a swim jig. We'll try it out. Maybe this little guy, I don't know. I just don't know. We'll try a swim jig, but I just got a feeling the hookup ratio is probably not gonna be great. Missed it on that uh, swim jig, so pitch that in there. 
Got him. Right on that little drainage uh, thing. Heck yeah. I thought there'd be one hanging out over there. Yeah, not bad. A little two pounder. Pretty girl. See you later. Right where I thought there'd be one. Got it. Nice, not a bad one. I get it. <laughs> Not bad. Heck yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Well, that jig hook's good, huh? Got it. Not too shabby. Thanks, little guy. Appreciate it. See you later. They're being finicky right now, that's for sure. Got it. <laughs> and there it goes. <laughs> that was a quick uh that was a quick catch and release. <laughs> Just kind of jacking around with this carp. Thought he grabbed it, but it ended up being a little decent little fish. <laughs> so that sucks. Didn't get it on camera, but bloody tell. Oh yeah. Got him on the Ocho. That'll be in the description. These things are awesome. This is my favorite stick bait right here. They're not much more durable than a, than a regular Senko. I just, I like them. They, you can get them way better colors. They're just, they're good. They're good stuff. Yeah, I just flipped it out right where that carp was. And, this, and that bass grabbed it. That was kind of funny. Is that Walker Wilson? No. <laughs> What's up? Yeah. Walker, you got some fans over there, bud. <laughs> Chill, bro. <laughs> All right. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, that's a fatty. That's a big old fish. Oh, don't flop. Oh, see that, it's got that hook is just kind of barely in there. Oh, maybe not barely, but damn. That's a good fish. That's a good and good and good. <laughs> Didn't really set the hook. That hook was barely in the roof of the mouth. That's a big fish, man. Jeez. 
That's a that's a good freaking fish. It's a tank. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, I don't have a scale with me. I definitely get a weight on this thing. That's a healthy fish right there. Real female. Let's get a good old release on her. Jeez, that's a big fish right there. What do you guys think this thing weighs? She's a monster. That's a good freaking pond fish right there. Alrighty. Let's let her go. Let's get the old release. That's freaking awesome. Big girl. Hell yeah. And, man, I just can't say it enough. These freaking, <laughs> these Ochos are freaking awesome. G-Lock hooks, hell yes. Catching monsters like that. Well guys, that's gonna do it for me. I wanna go home and uh, yeah, stay tuned. Uh, I'm gonna tell you about the, uh, about the little giveaway deal that I'm doing. All right guys, see y'all later. What's going on guys? So I've been working a lot. I haven't, let, I haven't put out a video in a, in a while. So I actually had one loaded up that uh, I just needed to finish editing and uh, film this part to uh, actually get it out there. So what I'm gonna do is, I know I run, in, I run into you guys all the time. Uh, I'll, see, I'll see you out fishing the local ponds and stuff. So the deal is, next time you guys see me, the first one to come up and, and say, what's up, just say hi. I'm gonna either give you, and I'm gonna keep these on me, so even if you, if you catch me, if you catch me at the grocery store or whatever, just come up, say what's up, and uh, I'll probably have it in the truck. But I'm gonna be giving away a pack of the uh, these Ochos right here, which is my favorite color. And uh, these things are awesome, they rock. Or I'll let you pick. So I'll be so I guess I can do two people. Or it's or I'm gonna give you this uh, chatterbait here. This is one of this is the Project Z chatterbait. So this is like this is one of their better ones. This is one of my favorite chatterbaits right here. And uh, black and blue can't beat it. I'm either throwing black and blue or some sort of green pumpkin brown natural looking color. But uh, yeah. This guy right here, or this guy right here, you pick. Just let me know, and uh, I'm gonna try to get some more uh, some more footage done. Uh, I'm actually working in Utah, so there, that's uh, that's big trout country, the Kokomo or Coca, some weird name trout or, <laughs> or, or something. I don't know. It's that's where I'm gonna be at. So I'm gonna be doing a little bit of that stuff. I'm gonna bring uh, the spinning gear and uh, and hopefully try to catch one of those guys. Is there a Speck of dust? What is this? No, guess not. I don't know what it was. So anyway guys, hopefully I'll be putting out some videos like that soon. I got some swim bait stuff, so I'm gonna be throwing some, chunking some swim baits. I've already been out throwing them around. It's a lot of fun. You don't get as many bites as you do on the old, uh, on the old stick baits or the, uh, or the chatter bait. So, hope you guys enjoy the video and uh, we'll see you later. So just hit me up and uh, and I'll give these guys to you. Peace.